It's the 12th of, no, 12th of January. It's the beginning of the year. Happy New Year, everybody. Happy New Year. Right. To be or not to be. That is the question. Whether it is nobler to suffer the slings and arrows of outrageous fortune or to take arms against a sea of troubles and by opposing end them. To die, to sleep, no more. And by a sleep, to say we end the heartache and the thousand natural shocks that flesh is heir to. Tis a consummation devoutly to be wished. To die. To sleep. To sleep, perchance, to dream. Aye, there's the rub. For in that sleep of death, what dreams may come when we have shuffled off this mortal coil uh, must give us pause. Now there's the respect that makes calamity of such long life. For who would bear the whips and scorns of time? The oppressor's wrong. The proud man's contumely. The pangs of despised love. The law's delay, the insolence of office, the patient merit of the unworthy makes. Sorry, the pa start again. <coughs> <coughs> to be or not to be, that is the question. Whether it is nobler to suffer the slings and arrows of outrageous fortune or to take arms against the sea of troubles and by opposing, end them. To, tie, to die, to sleep, no more. And by a sleep, to say we end the heartache and the thousand natural shocks that flesh is heir to. Tis a consummation devoutly to be wished. To die, to sleep, to sleep perchance, to dream. Ah, there's the rub. For in that sleep of death, what dreams may come? Where we have shuffled off this mortal coil, uh, must give us pause. And there's the calamity, the, sorry, there's the respect that makes calamity of such a long life. For who would bear the whips and scorns of time? The oppressor's wrong, the proud man's consumely, the law's delay. Uh, the, um, blah, blah, I can't remember the rest of the words now. Ports of office to pay some and Well, you know, that. you get the drift, don't I? Well, anyway, we were talking about the space between us all and the people who are, this is for Paul McCartney. And Ringo Starr, if you're still alive. We were talking about the space between us all and the people who hide themselves behind a wall of illusion and never glimpsed the truth. Then it's far too late when they pass away. Help me with this one. Hang on. We were talking about... Oh, I can't remember what we were talking about now. We were talking about the space between us all and the people who hide themselves behind a wall of illusion and never glimpse the truth. Then it's far too late when they pass away. We were talking about the love that's gone so cold. The love. We were talking about the love that's gone so cold. Something like that, anyway, I can't remember the rest of the words of hand, I just can't fucking be bothered to be honest. Anyway, there's a child in each one of us, right? Here's one of my ones. 
in this body, you know, well, in this life. Well, it's always this life, anyway. It's just my last body, you see. I'm running out of bodies. So this is my last one. <laughs> it's true. It's very true. This is my final body. I'm running out of bodies. And this is my final one. I'm getting kicked out of my home. If I get kicked out of my home, there won't be no come home, Bill Bailey, will there? I won't be able to come home because I thought I was home. You see, the idea was that I was to come home. I thought the idea was Bill Bailey, won't you please come home, sort of thing. I thought that was the idea of it. Bill Bailey, won't you come home? So I thought I was home, but now the council, well, I was home, and now the council wants to kick me out. So if I go, then I'm gone. <laughs> you know, won't you be gone, Bill Bailey? Won't you fuck off? Kind of thing the council says to me. We want to demolish your block of flats. Go away, Bill Bailey. We don't want you in Queen's House. Because we're going to knock down Queen's Warehouse and there won't be no Queen after that sort of thing. You want to demolish us. I want us to survive. I love the Queen. I love Queen's Warehouse. I want to stay here forever, Lizzie. I really want to Liz Elizabeth. I want to stay here forever in Queen's Warehouse. This was my forever home, I thought. I built my heaven here. My heaven. Now I've got to go away and start somewhere else. I'm not very happy about it at all. Anyway, I wrote another poem. I wrote a poem. Yeah. Drum up. And what you wrote? You remember when you published this in the spirit of the age? Murray Jameson, you published this one in the spirit of the age. I hope I can remember it. There's a child in each one of us trying hard to break free. A nervous, frightened child. 